Cultured meat to be sold in Singapore. Cultured meats approved for sale. Sell cultured chicken meat manufactured by Californian firm Eat Just has been approved by the Singapore Food Agency SFA for sale here. The chicken meat will be manufactured by Eat Just in facilities based in Singapore. SFA has, for the first time, used its new regulatory framework for novel foods to evaluate the cultured meat. The new framework pays attention to the manufacturing process, toxicity of ingredients, and if the finished product follows food regulation standards. Novel foods are products without a history of safe use. A history of safe use is defined by SFA to be food substances that have been consumed by a significant human population for at least 20 years without any negative health impact observed. As of now, cultured chicken meat will cost as much as premium chicken in a restaurant. The price tag should likely fall in the coming years as costs have already fallen to a third of what they were uh, last year in 2019. How is cultured meat made? While cell cultured meat is usually referred to as lab-grown meat on an industrial scale as uh, uh, they are for commercial production and non-experimentation, the meat is actually cultivated in bioreactors that resemble beer-brewing vats. The cells are removed from live animals via biopsy or obtained from an animal cell bank. They are placed in a nutrient-rich medium, which allows them to multiply and form a cell culture, which are then fed with nutrients into a bioreactor that simulates the body of an animal. When enough cells are grown, they are harvested and used in dishes like crispy chicken bites, savoury chorizo, sausages, and grilled chicken breasts. Effects of cultured meat Cultured meat is safer, cleaner, and more efficient than regular meat grown in live animals. Unlike regular meat, uh, cultured meat does not require antibiotics, uh, animal slaughter, uh, cannot contract illnesses like E. coli and uh, salmonella, and is unlikely to be contaminated. Factory farms, which rear animals that produce most of the world's meat uh, currently, are overcrowded and prone to disease. Factory farms are no more natural than their uh, well, cultured alternative as they employ methods such as artificial insemination and utilize vast quantities of growth hormones. Alternative proteins like cultured meat are more sustainable as they are not as land intensive. Uh, they only require factory space, of which uh, Singapore is plenty, and also re uh, need uh, less manpower. Uh, this would reinforce Singapore's food security. This is also a great step forward uh, to combat uh, climate change as our carbon footprint would be reduced. And this can be the solution to the Malthusian trap of a ballooning global population requiring more food. However, one must bear in mind that the livestock sector and their associated joint industries of wool, fibre and leather will be wiped out almost completely should cultured meat take off. Countries that depend heavily on clothing and livestock for employment will have a hard time coming forward.